Oh my god, I am numb. I've become numb. Oh, I can see the town. Oh, please. Oh, is the Khajiiti caravan out there? Oh my god, I've become frostbitten from cold. Oh, the caravan is in town. Ugh. Please! I'm about to turn into a fucking popsicle out here! I wish I could say that ah! I did not. But in Ooh, every part of Skyrim, go. there is talk of Oh god, we're still fucked. Oh, no. No coincidence. Please! Surrender, be Please, God, what no! Not divine, now. save me! <laughs> Talos, someone, anyone! Be fortunate. God! We travel like this. Oh! Oh, fuck! I need to- No! When we had last left the last dragonborn, they had traveled southward from Dawnstar at the behest of one of the townsfolk, or perhaps the Jarl, who could say for sure? The one thing that was sure, though, was that a giant needed to be slain. Indeed, it was seen as a threat to the small town of Don Donstar, and the Dragonborn took care of it swiftly and surely enough. However, in their travels did they encounter a strange problem with it that involved a farmer and a fool, yes, a jester. But luckily, the Dragonborn was able to defuse the situation before it got out of hand. But just what exactly was up with them? How odd did it seem? Perhaps more would come of that situation at a later date. Nonetheless, the Dragonborn found themselves in the creepy ruin of Volunrud, where they carried out the dying expedition of Hedic. Yes, they were meant to enter the final Elder's Cairn Chamber using two ceremonial weapons and unearth the secrets that lied within. This is the Elder Scrolls V, Skyrim. Welcome back. Zoop. There we go. Let's do it, huh? We got all our goodies here. We're fairly set up good enough, I guess, for now, right? Let's do it. Cairn door. Oh, shit. Oh, hey, there's the weapons. Oh, look at them go. Wow, this is like a unique animation and everything, huh? All right, defeat Kavenel. There we are. Is this, um, is this one of the priests? Is this our first priest? I don't know. This seems like a priestly situation, right? Oh shit, there's nothing in there. Let's see, anything else? A spare pick just out here. Fair enough. Another empty urn. And you can hear their power. Listen to that. What is that? A waterfall or some sort of magical essence overflowing? Embalming tools, salt pile, a burnt fucking dude? What is that? Scroll of Ice Storm. What the hell happened? They burned themselves on this fire? How? And how is the scroll related? Were they trying to use the scroll to like cool off or? What? Maybe they accidentally used the scroll and thought that they were cold, but were actually just burning themselves? Huh. Weird. Oh, shit. Oh, God. A million fucking assholes have suddenly awoken. Azir Trajizari. We'll take it. All right. Let's see. Let's rumble, dude. Send out some of our power here. Boom. Gotcha. Let's see, what have you got? Anything good? Ancient Nord shit. Fair dues. Let's turn this on. Top ourselves off just a bit. Good. Oh my gosh, a big overturned brazier. Oh god. Oh shit! Dude is up there! Alright. Let's do a run around here. Kick a pot all the way up. Ugh, pot kicking action. Oh shit, this is a death lord, huh? <laughs> okay. So get him! Let's see, do we still have our... Yes, let's give him the old... Boom! Chop into his fucking noggin. There we go. Good. Good. Excellent. Two-hander, too fucking slow. Alright, that's what the two and two-hander stands for. <laughs> Shit. I think we got a priest on our hands! Oh my gosh, our first of many, I hope. Good lord. 
<laughs> I, I say I hope. <laughs> just for some reason there, I, I installed a mod accidentally that just removes them all from the game. There go. Good. Great. Oh no! Look! It's old Evil Knievel! He's some sort of ghost zombie! Oh god, two great tastes that taste great together? There we are. Scream right into the wall. Stupid ghosts. There we go. Gosh, I'm getting so close to the wall, I'm like gonna get blinded, huh? <laughs> Jeez, look at Carjo charge in like a fucking champ. There we are. Good. Hey, quest complete. What's up here? Oh, it's the Archer Lord. Uh, send out one of those. Ah! Useless. <laughs> oh! Useful. So powerful. The supersonic blast from me swinging my axe so quickly is what did them in, not the actual contact with it. It was the, uh, it was the, like, shockwave. <laughs> All right. Let's see. Should we get this first? Why not? It's screaming at me. Oh, what is your secret word of the day? It's life or a whisper. What? Oh, d is it like detect life? Is that it? All right. Let's see. Ghostly remains. Oh, it's a douche, an oaken. Some cool weapons. All right. Hey, yeah, these aren't half bad. These are frost damage, huh? Useful. Okay, but uh, really... Really, ultimately, not that useful. <laughs> useful, but, uh, you know. <laughs> Let's see, can we pass them on? Us, I'll smell them coming. Or I might not. We will see. <laughs> Fair enough. I don't think I ever traveled with a Khajiiti companion before in uh, old Skyrim land. I don't believe so. I will so. shoulder some of your burden. Let's see. Let's take a look. Oh, jeez, man. Okay, well. <laughs> what can you take? Some of this iron shit? Ooh, that's just barely enough, actually. Let's see, some troll fat, bone meal. Oh my gosh, it was enough. There we go. Beautiful. We follow that. Thank you, Karsha. What a lifesaver. Now, hopefully there's no amazing treasures inside this amazing treasure chest. <laughs> what are the chances of that? <laughs> what lurks within? Oh, Spell Tome Ice Spike. Oh, shit. Some amazing treasure. <laughs> okay. Can I can I equip this, though? Do I have my... Oh, look. I have my stupid price barter thing still equipped like a fool. Which means... Boom. 25 extra. Oh, what a lifesaver. All right. Let's see. Should we take this? Certainly we should. I believe we've read it before. Let's see if we get a skill point. Nope. Or we'll take it. I'm not sure if we have read it though. I think we have. I'll have to cross check the uh, old cross checkeroo. Ocean of Light Feet, Grief and Viz. Fun axe. How do these axes look? Do they look fun enough? They look alright. They look alright. I really need to go through and look at all the axes in the game, right? Like I said uh, at the beginning of the playthrough, I feel like it's, it's only appropriate given that we're in Skyrim that my character make use of an axe, right? Okay, let's turn this on. There we are. Beautiful. Anything good around here? Hidden around in nooks and crannies? Could be. But well, maybe not. Yeah, I don't think so. I can kick some jugs around. Love that. All right. Cool, the final chamber. Oh, look, very cold here. Oh, they put all their shit right in front of the art. <laughs> Could you imagine being uh, asked to carve this shit out of the stone? And then either do it right here in this stone or move it, haul it up in here. And then whoever chills out and rules here. Oh, look, a free garnet. Thanks, Gordon. But whoever chills out and rules here, fucking, they just cover your shit up. Look, you can't even see the second owl. What's going on? You covered up the beautiful owl. Oh, what a dick. No wonder they called him the tongue because he was... Because he was an asshole. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> All right. <laughs> that, was, that was bad even for me. <laughs> All right. Turn this on here. Oh, look. <gasps> but you know what's good? Secret treasure. Oh, my 
God, how do I get to it? Ugh. 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 Nailed it. A dwarven warhammer. A flawless emerald. <laughs> we'll leave the warhammer. Okay. There we go. Beautiful. Anything on you now? We've checked you like a million gazillion times, huh? All right. Look, the hits don't stop coming. How many treasure chests have they got in here? Oh, what's this? A turn up. A turn urn. Let's see. Treasure. Five quatlus. Oh my god. Don't spend it all in one place. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Sorry, I'm I'm just on a roll today, aren't I? I'm terrible. <laughs> Alright. Oh, Dragon Priest Dagger. Well, what is this doing here? Oh. Why is this here? Huh. Oh look, my my stem is bugged up. There we go. Problem solved. Good. Oh yeah, we should also check what the shout actually fucking does, huh? Your voice is not a shout, but a whisper, revealing the life forces of any and all. Ah, exactly as we thought. Okay. Let's unlock it as well. We got a lot of fucking units here. A minor maze. Oh, uh, look at that. Huh. Weird, but there was no dragon priest in here. Right? Hmm. Weird. Alright. For the few who have no idea what I'm talking about. Hold on to your butts. All will be revealed in... Well, in due time? Mm, in some amount of time. <laughs> in some amount of time. Let's see. Suffice it to say... They really did up the ante as far as rewarding your exploration in Skyrim land, right? All right, let's see. I think we got everything we need. We got it all. Can I unsocket the fun other weapons and shit or what? I don't think so. I think we need to hold on to this Adusian Oaken, right? Isn't that like relevant in another quest? I want to say. I'm not sure. Nonetheless, we have zero plans to sell it off. If I did theoretically sell it off, is there, is like vendor shit permanent? Is there, is there um, holdings of items that you've sold to them? Is that kept on them indefinitely? Similar to Morrowind and I think Oblivion? No, Oblivion cleaned them out, didn't they? Yeah, they put them in like a storage chest or something hidden away. But is that the case in Skyrim land? I don't know. Nonetheless, it is not a mistake I will make. Fear not, for I am watchful. Alright. Oh shit. I'm not watching these bones, though. Messing me the hell up. Alright. Old Hedic Volunar. What a champ. What a guy. Let's see. We did get to level 90... What do you call it? Level 90 Conjuration. Is that enough to get, like, some wild shit? I'm not sure. Hmm. Conjuration. Let's see, up here. Now it requires a hundred. But at what level can we learn the really cool spells, right? Hmm. It might be 90. You might be able to learn them before you can become a, like, true uh, proper master or whatever. Let's see. Head on over up here. The air is freezing frigid. It's awful. What else is new? Okay, let's see. Volun Rude is complete. <laughs> Sorry if you can hear the love dog having a party in the other room. <laughs> let's see. Dawnstar up there. Should we just, like, mosey on over from the Lord's Stone? Hmm. We could. I mean, that's almost a straight shot, right? We could, like, run down here. Yeah, maybe we do that. Maybe we do that. Okay. Yeah, let's, let's fucking go. Okay, let's see. Let's equip our whirlwind sprint because we're going to need it for these treacherous areas, right? Okay, we're going to make a just straight <gasps> shot for the Lord Stone, right? I think that's a good bet. We better eat some food as well because, look, we're kind of in need. Let's eat a... Ooh, I don't want to eat a raw snoot. Okay, what else do I have? It's like the heaviest food that I've got. Wait... Ah, venison chops. Right. Okay. Give that a munch. Okay, good, good, good. 
And we'll avoid all of these other cool markers here, because you know what, we're... We've already got a lot on our fucking plate, or on our table, for the time being, right? There's always time to come back for more. Alright. There we are. Boom! Speed on along. Oh, jeez. Getting chilled up big style. I think maybe once we turn this in, uh, we'll set up shit at the new area. Well, no, because we don't- I don't know yet who I want to live there, right? I don't know who I want living out there. Yeah, so maybe not. We'll just unlock the ability to have it, right? Because we can't build the carriage until we assign someone there. Oh, who should we- who should we have live there? Fuck no to Mercurio. Mercurio is just a fucking sellsword, right? Jeez, maybe we'll have like a guild friend or something do it, <laughs> right? <laughs> I think you can do that, right? Surely. Yeah, you must be able to. All right, there we go. Right by Hall of the Vigilant, which we were trying to so deftly avoid last time. Boom! We can still, we can still make it happen. Oh God. Oh God. What is this? There's some terrible shit around here. Is it because I'm getting close to Dim Hollow? It must be. Okay. There we are. Up and over here. We'll have to use Become Ethereal to survive this. I th well, I don't know. Wow, look at that. What a nice view. If it weren't for the fact that my vision is now totally <laughs> fucked up from the cold. <laughs> Alright. Fair enough. Let's see. Let's check our map again. Okay, right up here. Red Road Pass. Very well. I don't know if we actually went through there. Red Road Pass. I don't know. Oh shit, okay, we might need it now. Oh shit, what is this? Oh shit, Hall of the Vigilant. Oh, avert your eyes! Don't look, Marion. There we are. Trying to hold on to my... my shout cooldown. Alright. Up and over here. There we go. There's a nice little path. Okay. I'll take that. Uh, there we go. Good. Beautiful. Love it. Okay. Cool. Didn't even need Become Ethereal. Didn't even need it. Let's do a quick save here. Alright. And then... We may as well stow our weapons. I have no idea if it makes you run any faster. I have no idea. And I've asked it before. I'm just too damn dumb to commit it to memory. <laughs> All right. Let's see. Over here. Good. And then we can just home in on the uh, the quest marker, right? We could see if we can get some warmth over here at this giant camp or whatever, right? We're fucking freezing out here. Should we take a quick peek? I think we should. Look, there's some free cheese out here just as well. Oh. Sounds delicious. Oh god, what's that ominous noise? Okay. Did we clear it out? Red Road Pass? Oh shit, there's something over- Oh! It's a big man! Okay. And once again, their flames are not giving me any respite from the cold. Okay. <laughs> okay, see ya! I need to get out of here, otherwise I'm gonna die. Boom! There we are, super speed mode. Let's see, there's some sick bastard out here in the wilds. Who would be out here? It's a fucking wolf. Please! There's another one somewhere. Take all that shit. Why not? Okay. Oh, you fucker! There we go. Gotcha. Man, it's gonna be close, huh? Look at this, it's coming down to the wire. Oh dear god, are we gonna make it? Or are we gonna fucking die out here? Jeez, am I gonna freeze to death? <laughs> oh my god, why is this always so fucking stressful? <laughs> Alright. Let's scarf down some of this shit so I can just keep sprinting forever. Oh god. I think we have- we- We're gonna make it, right? That said, it is ultra cold out here, and it's snowy. Oh god. Boom! Oh god. <laughs> okay, it's fine. It's fine. We're just gonna drink all this shit so we can keep sprinting. Potions of stamina. Look, I would just sell them anyway. 
<laughs> this is look, this is what they're actually good for, for being able to sprint through the fucking cold. Alright. Oh my god, I am numb. I've become numb. Oh I can see the town! Boom! Oh please! Was oh, the Khajiiti caravan out there? Oh my god, I've become frostbitten from cold! Oh, the caravan is in town! Ugh. Please! I'm about to turn into a fucking popsicle out here! I wish I could say that ah! I did not. But in Ooh, every part of there we Skyrim, go. there is talk of Oh god, we're still fucked. Oh no! no coincidence. Please! Surrender, be Please, God, no! Not divine, save me! <laughs> Talos, someone, anyone! God! Oh! Oh fuck! I need to no! You to no! Good. Shut the fuck up! Glad we straightened that out. Please, God, no! Ah! I work for the wind peak in. Oh my God! Welcome. Let me know if you want. Oh jeez. I I got a clean. Am I like dying? Am I going to die? Heat me up, please! Heat me up! Oh thank goodness! Oh my God! I thought that guy was about to fucking kill me from from shouting. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's so nice. I'm just going to roll around in the flaming logs. Cinders everywhere. Look at me. I'm a Dark Souls protagonist. Oh, light every fire up. Oh my gosh, yes. Give me that. Just burn me. Just burn me. Just kill me with fire. Turn me into ash and shit. Good God. Whoa. Oh. <sighs> That's what, the third time we've almost died from freezing to death? I think. <laughs> Good Lord. Honestly, it's stressful, but I kind of like it. <laughs> oh, jeez. We could have used, that said, we could have used the, uh, the camping supply, right? But I kind of like trying to get by without it, right? We, it was, it was feasible enough for us to make it, right? Okay, there we go. Are we fully restored? I think we are. Oh, <sighs> yeah, we are. Okay, let's rent. I'm sorry, room. my mind was just somewhere else. Do you need a room? Drink? Thoring, it better fucking not be. Not after all the shit I did. I killed some guy. Oh, do you need a room? Yeah. Sure thing. It's yours for a day. Great. Okay. Let's see, what time of day is it? Ooh, it's 7 a.m. Okay. Right this way. We may just snooze for like a million years. All right. Up and over. There we go. Thank you. Let's see. Let's go for 23 hours. Why the hell not? Why the hell not? Who do we even need to turn this quest into out here? The Jarl, I guess. Right? Surely. Turn that in claim our prize, get our little area purchased. I guess if we purchase it, we'll be able to take a carriage over to it, right? Even if we don't build up the carriage? Maybe? Right? Surely? Okay. Let, me Let us eat a little snack here. Let's see. Should we eat the cheese bowl? If there's anything... Eh, let's... Let's eat a venison chop. You need. There we go. All right. Is there a place where I can cook some shit up, though? Hmm. Doesn't seem that way. I think it's the Khajiiti caravan is what I need, right? Oh, God. Okay, I thought that was... I thought this kid was dead in a fucking corner. <laughs> I was like, jeez, I thought I helped Dawnstar. <laughs> There's a dead child lying on the ground in the inn. What the fuck? <laughs> All right. <laughs> I was like, whoa, I thought they couldn't die in this game. Did, did I miss something? <laughs> is this a mod? What the fuck has the Creation Club done? <laughs> All right. Let's go, let's go up over here. Let's see. Where is... Hmm. Over here? No. Khajiiti Caravan. Up here. Right? Right? Yeah, this has got to be it. All right. Good, good, good. Okay. Oh, I believe we have some salt on us. If not, let's uh, let's chat with Carjo for a bit. 
and grab a few salt piles, right? Yeah, we can cook here. Nice. All right. Hey, Carjo. You are taking us somewhere warm. I will Eventually. shoulder some of your burden. Eventually, Karja, we will be going to somewhere warm. Let's see. Salt pile. Oh, I guess I have them all on me. Yeah. All two of them. <laughs> Great. We follow that. Okay. Well, let's at least cook up the snooter, right? Because that shit's heavy as hell. Mammoth steak. There we go. And some of these remaining salmons, of which we have 60 fucking seven. <laughs> Great. Okay. Cool. Let's see. Karjo, do you have anything you to sell on you? somewhere warm. I will shoulder some of your burden. Let's see. Oh, yeah, look at all this shit. Okay. Let's see. We'll take all these. And should we keep a bow on him? Eh, it's fine. I like him being in melee. There we are. And should we take... Uh, hmm. He seems to prefer the dagger, right? He seems to prefer swords. So you know what? We'll let him have uh, his preference here, right? Okay. And then... The shock boots. Fair enough. Anything else here? Now the rest will keep. We follow then. Okay. I sure hope you're the vendor. <laughs> I sure hope it's you. All right. Or maybe it's that person right there. Hey, Zainabi. The warm sand okay. of elsewhere is far away from here. All right. Well, I'm going far away from here too. Bye. Bye. Hey, Akari. So many refuse to talk to us. They call us thieves and smugglers. I am glad to see that you are not such a one. Mm. Yeah, it, we said it before, I'll say it again. Super fucked up. All right. Let's see here. Let's get rid of this shit. Good. Ebony arrows, ebony bow. Oh, great. We can't get rid of anything else. Okay, what do you have on you? Anything worth buying? Any enchants that we're missing? Let's see. We definitely are missing out on some. Oh, look, we can buy some potions. Let's do it. Good. Should I buy some cure disease, perhaps? Mm, maybe, maybe. We could buy a weak paralysis poison. That's useful just as well. We could buy some of these weird, cool new units, right? Hmm. Not until we, no, nah, not until we cap out our uh, alchemy at least once will we start to make use of all these, right? Okay. Yeah. You know what? That's a that's a great like internal rule to have. I think, right? I, I like the sound of that. All right, we'll buy some soul gems, though, because we can use those. Level up our enchanting and shit. Let's see, what else have you got? Flawless garnet. Should I buy some, like, animal hide? I could use it, right? Well, let's see. How far, uh... How far can we go selling off more of this shit, right? Let's see. Glass bow. Scimitar. Oh, my gosh. Speech went up. Jeez. All right, over here... Yep, this thing of imminent destruction. Some boots. Anything here? Deft hands. Do I want to keep that? Yeah, I want to keep that. I do. Let's get rid of the shock boots, though. Definitely. Deft hands ring. Yeah, we'll keep that as well. Let's see. This necklace. Yep, keeping that. Studded armor of the squire. Ditching it. Okay, good. You know what? I think that's pretty good for... Oh, we've got all these scrolls, though. Right. Here, let's buy some more gems. There we go. Good. Are there any of these scrolls that I'd like to keep? These direct damage ones I don't really need. The summon I don't really need. Fury is only level 4, level 12. Let's see. Freezing Whirlwind, that's actually useful. And Mass Paralysis is super useful. Not that I'm sure we'll even need it at this point, but, you know. Just nice to have a little trick up our sleeve just in case right okay you know what that turned out pretty well may your road lead you to one sands all right great let's go turn this into the yarl i guess going up over here oh man dawnstar does look pretty nice when uh, the weather is in complete garbage <laughs> all right oh look oh yeah get some snowberries wait Oh. I know you. <laughs> you motherfucker. Could you imagine if I died from that? You should get charged with fucking murder if I turned into a popsicle while you were... Wait, I know you ing me. You piece of shit. Oh, look. What's going on? Oh, snoozing and losing, huh? Jarl scowled. You're not as dumb as you look. Yeah, the giant and blizzard rest is dead. Uh, 
shown those monsters that they will no longer be tolerated Are they in monsters? the pale. Good work. Here, a reward from your Jarl. I think he's just a shitty old man, right? The giants really seem peaceful, right? They just don't want to be fucked with or have their mammoths fucked with, right? Which is totally fair enough, right? If anything, we should be figuring out how to become friends and, like, chat with them and stuff, right? Jeez. Alright, anything else you need, my Jarl? There is room in my court for a new sage. Oh, really? It's an honorary title, mainly. But there are a few perks someone like you could make use of. <gasps> However, I could only grant the title to someone who is known throughout my hold. Oh. You help my people, and I'll make you my fame. Oh, okay. Sure, it would be an honor. How many more do I need Good to help? Luck. Oh, three more out of nowhere. Okay, fair enough. <laughs> I think, can't Radiant Quests also suffice this requirement if you get them from, like, the inn or whatever? So long as it's from the appropriate town. Don't those also work? I think? I'm not sure. I don't know if I've ever had to do that, though. I'm not sure. It's been too long, even if I did or didn't. Anyway, can I, can I buy some of that plot of land? Yes, it is. It's in the southern part of the Pale, right on the border with White Run Hold. All the room in the world to build your own house. Oh, cool. Hey, can I get a discount? Because, you know, it's so fucking cold up here. <laughs> the other places I, I went to, you know, well, okay. You know, to be fair, one of the two other places is pretty bad. I don't know what's worse. Really cold place or place filled with vampires and giant acid bugs. Mm. <laughs> All right, I'll take it. Wonderful. I'll sleep better knowing you're watching the Southern Marches. Here's the title to your standing. <laughs> yeah. Just follow the road yeah, you're south of Dawnstar past Fort Dunstad. <laughs> then head south. The land oh. is near Giant's Gap, right on the border with White Run Hold. You'll almost be inside of the Laureus Farm, in fact. Oh, really? Okay. Huh. Well, I, I just met them not too long ago, actually, Jarl Scald. Good lord. Don't bother me again unless it's important. Okay, yeah, I'll keep an eye on the southern flank or whatever. I'll keep an eye. I'll make sure... I'll make sure Dawnguard is safe from those Dawn Imperials. Oh, I'd never want the Imperials to show up and do whatever. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna make that man eat shit. <laughs> <laughs> or wait, is he is he with the Empire? No, he's he's a Stormcloak, isn't he? He he loves uh, Ulfric, right? Yeah, yeah. All right, let us see. Let's go on up over to. Do we have a quest to go check out our new area? Let's see. Ah, yeah. View your new property in the Pale Hold. Uh, okay. Where is it exactly? Oh God. Okay. <laughs> yeah, that's it. Okay. Good God, should we just run for it again? Or what? <laughs> Is it better to start from Whiterun at this point? I mean, we literally almost died. We literally almost died last time. Okay, you know what? We're gonna play it safe. We're gonna play it safe. Let's take a boat to somewhere and then we'll take a carriage to Whiterun, right? There we go. Up and over here. Good, good, good. And it's not this huge, amazing, Wait, cool boat that we take. That. Everyone it's thinks I'm this too young to be a ship's captain. This little I'm fucking rinky dink dingy. All right, what's up, dude? Looking to hire a boat? Yeah, I can take you to any port on the coast. Where are you headed? Okay, let's go to. Do I need to go to either of these places for anything like thieves guild related? Let's take a quick peek. Let's see, numbers job. Delvin. Okay. Burglary job. Mark Hearth. Okay. Mm -hmm. Till next. May not look like much, but my boat can get you there faster than walking. Where are you headed? I'm headed to solitude. Why not? Climb on in the boat the and get comfortable. All right. Good, good. Uh, where do I? There we are. Yeah, he may not look it, but he's actually, like, extremely powerful. As soon as we get in there, he starts, like, his arms start moving almost as fast as, like, the speed of sound. He's, like, paddling at supersonic speeds. There's just a flurry torrent of water flying behind us as we're, like, sailing through the through the waters. 
He like outruns all these giant ships. He's just going like comically fast. <laughs> the boat is like skipping over waves. He like there's a giant tidal wave approaching, drills right through it. Our our whole like little boat Good business does like a corkscrew Empire. spin right it's through it to drill right through. It. <laughs> does a little drill sound effect. Oh god, what just happened? <laughs> what? <laughs> What was that about? All right, let's take the horse machine. Here we go. Horse machine, Need please. A ride? Yes, take me over to. Take you to any of the... Where do you want to go? I want to go to White Run, please. Twenty qualus. I'll take Climb it. And back, and we'll be off. There we are. All right, let's Get be up. off. Good, good, good. And you know what? Hey, if if he had a good enough like ramp with a wave. Dude could just send us blasting all over Skyrim, right? He could drop us off midway through. <laughs> don't underestimate his skill as like a tradesman specialist. Don't under don't underestimate the ability of old Hell Hellurgler. What's his thing? <laughs> don't underestimate that man. Don't don't underestimate him. <laughs> Good God. <laughs> Get me out of here. I need to sleep. <laughs> all right. There we go. Pop up this. Good, good, good. Hey, look at this. Hey, no uh, level of detail bug, right? Honestly, I was kind of expecting it given all the fast traveling, right? Jeez. Also, part of my <laughs> Morrowind instinct is kicking in. All that fast traveling back to back, I'm tempted to like, oh, I better save. I might, might crash the desktop here. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking uh, sound and graphics overhaul pack. I am your what sword and your shield. All right, there we go. And let's take a little quick snooze. Good. We're probably gonna get a dragon, you know. Now that I think of it, jeez. Let's see. Let's go for eh, six hours. That's good. And then we'll chow down on something. Are we still numbed or debilitated from how fucking cold we got that one day? We might be. We very well may be. Let's eat that. You know what? It's time to chow on some cheese. Mmm, cheese bowl. God, that seems disgusting. Oh, it made me hungrier. What? Eating the cheese made me hungrier? Am, when I eat it, does it, like, make me throw up? What just happened? What the fuck happened with that cheese? Huh. Or did it not register yet that I had slept? Was I too quick on the, uh, on shooting into the inventory there? What happened? Huh. Okay. Well, we're fine now. Okay. Honor to you, my pain. Let's get on out of here. There we are. Probably get a fucking dragon along the way, right? Brace for impact. Hopefully it's a baby one. We can just annihilate it easily enough. Okay. Let's see. Let's grab a quick horse as well. Oh, look. We don't even need to. Moose Mabel is in town. Yeah! Oh, I tried to do a... I tried to... Yeah, hang on. Can, can I actually do it? Can I do, like, a jumping mount? Can I... Yeah! Oh, shit. <laughs> no, you can't. You actually have to land. Okay. <laughs> Okay, fair enough, fair enough. Let's get on out of here, right? Let's see. We want to scope and skip out this place. All right, you know what? We'll approach it from this end, from the western side of White Run. There we go. Good. Oh, look, these are still regrowing here. Good. All right. Beautiful. Hey, what if it said you just can't sprint jump in heavy armor? What if that's it? And this whole time I've been like a fool. And that's like a heavy armor restriction. I can see that being the case. I don't know if it's true, though. Granted, I I, I have no idea if it's true. <laughs> but it would, it would make sense. I could see that. Why not? That seems like a fair enough restriction to me. All right. Up and over here, especially being as, you know... Oh, shit. There it is. There it is. All right. Come and get me. Go, Moose Mabel! Go, go, go! Too bad this thing can't fly. When this Moose Mabel hits 88 miles per hour, you're gonna see some serious shit. 
Ooh. <laughs> if only. Okay. What kind of dragon is this? It looks like a, a weak baby one. Oh, shit. Getting attacked by wolves. Okay. Yo, is this thing gonna land? Come and get me, you big bastard! Oh, shit. There it is. Ooh, who's it breathing on? Some weird... Oh, God. What the fuck is this place? Okay. Halted stream camp. Okay. Oh, jeez. Fortunately, you can't rotate your camera completely in, like, 360 degrees when you're doing this shit. Alright, you know what? Let's shoot it. Let's shoot it a bit. Lightning bolt. Okay. Forgot I was in third person. I was like, oh god, where'd my hands go? Okay. Good. Oh shit, it fucking landed. Oh shit, that's an elder dragon. Okay. Let's see. Let's re-equip our necklace, right? We need that for this encounter here. There we are. And that, yep, also good. Oh shit, actually we're encumbered at the moment because of it. Okay, here, let's do a filter uh, or something of strength. Anything. I'll take anything. Let's take some resist fire, in fact. Wasn't it a fire dragon? I think so. Okay, let's see. Potion of strength. That'll do. Ah! Oh no, it's a frosty one. It's a frosty dragon. Okay. We can handle that, though. Let's get some frosty potion. There we are. Beautiful. Oh, you dick. Okay. Who's out here? Bandits? Yeah. Good. Perfect. Alright. Is everyone, like, waging war? Oh, shit. It's complete chaos. Oh, God. Woo! Oh, uh, please! Oh, I think they're fighting a, a giant. Yeah. Okay. Beautiful. There we go. Yeah! Ooh! Jeez, it almost sent me flying with it. Okay. Was well, my stem fucked up? Let's see. Let us repair this real quick. There we go. Good. Alright. Come and get me! You gonna land? Yeah, you are. There we are. Beautiful. Going great. Ooh. Yes. Eat shit, Elder Dragon. Got a little touch and go there at the end, but it's fine. All right. Hey, look. Check this out, giant. Check it out. Guess who I am? Yeah. Have you heard of me? Have your folks ever whispered words of the Deborn? Check it out. I'm absorbing it. Yeah. It's cool, huh? Whoa. What do you? Oh, okay. I need. I need to check that body now for real. <laughs> Sorry. I want this. I know you helped a little bit, but yeah, I'm gonna ninja loot it, dude. I'm gonna. I'm gonna ninja loot it. I'm taking all that shit. G Karcho, come take these fucking bones. Karcho, where have you gone? God, he's probably still back there fighting the fucking bandits. Karjo, come back! I have a million bones! Oh, God. Oh, shit, I can <gasps> hear some chaos over there. Oh, no, stray dog as well. Okay. Oh, lightning bolt! Lightning bolt! There we go. Get him, Moose Mabel! Oh, fuck, I'm going so slow. Karjo, where are you? <laughs> Karjo, the hero! Get him with your power dagger! Oh shit! Fuck him up! Yeah! Oh my god. Everyone survived! Alright. You are taking us somewhere warm, I trust. It is warm here, I Karjo. Will shoulder some of your burden. Let's see. What do you want to take? How about uh, these? There we go. Oh god, where'd they go? 
Oh, jeez. Oh, shit. He can't carry it anymore. Oh, my God. <laughs> well, that's not good. He's got too much shit on him. Okay, Lead fair dues. Let's see. Let's take this stuff. There we are. Should we investigate this fun little uh -huh. camp real quick? I think so, right? We're in the area. Wolf with a pelt. Some sort of bone chime uh -huh. here. God, this is nasty. What are you all, vampires or what? <laughs> oh, vampires are gross, huh? Let's see. What's going on over here? Anything? Can vampires sustain themselves off of, like, animal blood? They can, can't they? In Elder Scrolls, can't they? I don't know. Like, I don't think it's as good for them as, as like, mortal blood, right? But they could sustain themselves off of, like, sucking off a mammoth or whatever. Hmm. All right. Take some of these. Got some grilled leeks over there, over yonder. Oh, look. They've got their own little interior thing here. Got some potatoes out front. Love it. Lots of salt as well. Cabbages, I'll take two, eat two. Garlic. Okay. The car show's having fun. Hey, maybe we should explore the rest of this, right? Maybe that's something we should do. Take two, eat two. Eat all of these. Okay. Good. You know what? Yeah, let's check out the rest of this, huh? Why the hell not? Rip up some flowers. What is this place again? Steam... Halted Stream Camp. Okay. Sure. Probably a place you're very likely to explore early on, right? Given its uh, proximity to Whiterun. Oh, look. A secret trap. Oh, hey. A secret dude. Just as well. Alright. Please, no one kill me with that. Man, this guy is so, like, fucking deaf. He didn't hear any of that! <laughs> Not even Stray Dog! Huh? Oh, now you hear shit, huh? Ah! Hear that! <laughs> oh my god, that was pretty violent. <laughs> Alright, cool. Let's see. Anything else good here? Ooh, look, what the fuck are you all doing? What the fuck are they doing? They're farming up mammoths in here and shit? What's going on? Alright, that's fucking weird. Let's see, what can I ditch? Jeez. This shit is heavy, huh? What's going on? Just a bunch of heavy shit. Jeez, jeez, jeez. Hmm. Alright, let's re-equip the charm necklace, I guess. F it. We killed the dragon. Alright. Let's see. Should we do a little bit of mining here just as well? I think so. Why not? There we go. Iron ore. We need it. We can use it on our new building facility or whatever, right? Lord knows we're gonna have plenty of need for it. Alright. Good. Anything else around here? Should we take the tusks? Oh god. Okay, we shouldn't have done that. <laughs> Alright. Let's see. Mammoth Tusk. I mean, I do kind of need them, just not at the moment, right? Here, let's drop some of these. You know what? We can we can get these on the run back. There we go. I can pop a potion, and then we'll run up to whatever land. Alright, what have we got here? Minor healing restoratives. Some ore on the floor. I can't even reach it. Wow, I still can't reach it. There we go. Good. Alright, some ore over here. Good. Okay, is that everything? I think so. Activate the trap. Oh look, more ore. Good. Okay. There's some tusks and stuff that we threw down. It's fine. Let's pick into this. Nailed it. Lovely. Alright. Jump 
this on. Oh, look. Some more fucking ore. Too bad you can't just, like, stealth mine all of it. Right? You just, just sneak in and mine it all out from under them. <laughs> just have a team of rogues get hired to, like, mine all of the gold out from under the, uh, that shitty Markarth family. <laughs> Just when they're not looking. Yeah. Okay, oh jeez. Oh shit, deflected. Oh fuck. Alright. Got you. Good shit. Whew. Got a little rough there, huh? Good God, what is this disgusting place? Oh, are they poaching mammoths? Is that it? Oh, man, and I thought I was what I was doing was fucking nasty. Oh, y'all are fucked up. Y'all moved the entire mammoth inside of the cave? <laughs> All right, that's a little weird, too. <laughs> Why not just do it outside and, like, feel... Oh, my God! Spell Tome transmute mineral ore! This is what we've needed! Oh, yes! Let me have that! Let's see. Oh, yes! Transmute one piece of unrefined iron ore to silver, or silver ore to gold if the caster is carrying any. Oh, my God. We're rich. <laughs> We're rich. Suddenly leveling blacksmithing. Piece of cake. Piece of cake. There we go. All right. Beautiful. Potion of health, minor healing, regular healing. Oh, look, they were trying to do it there, too. <laughs> All right. Pretty clever. Why not just have a... Oh, and that was their wizard, too, who was converting all of it. Honestly, kind of genius, right? Let's see. There we go, except for the part where... Why did they need the mammoths? What was the point of all this, right? They had a good thing going with the uh, the iron ore to silver. <laughs> why, why kill all the mammoths? I don't know. Maybe she needed like soul gems for something. All right, what's in our treasure here? Hide shield of dwindling flames. I guess I'll take it. Okay, not looking great on the carry weight front. All right, Carjo, are you really full to your limit, though, Carjo? How how are you? Kajit got your back. Let's see, trade some stuff. I will shoulder some of your burden. Let's see here. How about a shitload of iron ore? Wow, really not that much, huh? Okay. Lido. Fair enough. Let's see. Let's drink a potion of strength. Oh, there we go. Friend. Exactly what I wanted. Great. Okay. Anything else? God, look at that. That looks kind of gross right there. Jeez. All right. Let's turn on the lights. Wow, look at all these tusks and snoots. Dude, y'all are fucked up. Why? Why were they doing it? Just to eat, I guess? I don't know. And how? How did they get away with it, too? You would think that the, uh... The giants would not allow that whatsoever, right? Huh. I'll apply that poison. There we go. Good. Oh, shit. Come on, team. Come on, team. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on, stay dog! Come on! <laughs> Great. Worked out. <laughs> Alright. Oh, look. This is one of the booby traps, huh? Yeah, it totally is. Alright. Oh, look. More ore. All of this is fucking gold! Ooh! Jeez. Sorry, Carjo. Look, we went somewhere warmer. Jeez, where are we gonna come out at? Oh, God! Oh, what the hell? Dude, okay. This explains a lot. 
How's that? Some fucking environmental storytelling. Alright. Coin purse over here. Is this gonna hurt me if I just walk into it? <laughs> God. I like clenched up a bit. <laughs> okay. I think we're fine. Let's let's go back in. Oh, jeez. Alright, there we are. Okay, and then yep, this thing came down. Yeah, it, it came down. <laughs> Don't make it do it again. Alright. Please no. Alright. Yeah, I think we've got most everything. If anything, you know what? Yeah, I'll loot I'll loot all this shit and mine up the rest in between videos. That seems like a good plan. We'll do some inventory management. We'll probably have to ditch something. Because I would like to make away with all this ore, right? Especially now that we have our brand spanking new super cool ability. Alright, yeah, seems like a plan. Okay, but if you would like to stick around, we will of course be doing him. What's on this bandit chief? Alright, and there's another one here, isn't there? Yeah, bandit outlaw. Ooh, that's pretty nice. Let's see. Wasn't there a third one as well? Somewhere around here? Yeah, there you are. Outlaw. Poacher's axe. Oh. Huh. Isn't this unique? It might be. All right, we're taking it. All right, yeah. If you'd like to stick around, we will, of course, be doing a little bit of reading. What are we reading this time? But we're finishing out our third volume of Dwemer Inquiries. Ah. How about that? Let's see. Dwemer Inquiries, volume three. If you'll excuse me, I'm going to take a quick drink here. Sorry about this. Dwemer Inquiries, Volume 3, Their Architecture and Civilization, by Thelwe Galeen, Scholar. Let's see, let me also check this off on my list. There we are. Yip zip jabba deep. My studies and this text have focused heavily on the fact that Dwemer archaeological sites west of Vardenfell seem to be built at much greater depths than their counterparts near the Red Mountain. I believe there was a specific threshold to which dwarven excavators would dig before the construction of vital structures would begin. I have referred to this threshold as the geocline, but I've found that too often to be I've found that to often be redundant with the deep venue of a colony. Still, there is some variation in the actual depth of a deep venue. Whereas the geocline is always the marker where I reason the city proper begins. Tunnels and chambers at more shallow depths while often... And of course, remember the, the venue? The deep venue is like um, the center area from which all of the rest of a Dwemer ruin will branch off from, right? Like, we've seen a few that are, like, uh, very vertical step areas, ver vertical ramps, and then there's, like, three or four different branches in a different direction or whatever, at minimum. Very common in Skyrim's Dwemer ruins. All right. Tunnels and chambers at more shallow depths, while often grand in their architectural style, appear to have served little in the way of critical civic purpose. Surplus stores of food, warehouse chambers that may have been used in trading with nearby surface settlements, or barracks for topside patrols are common above the geocline. These tunnels, I have observed, can meander in a seemingly more random pattern than those planned structures beneath. I hypothesize that this may be due to the unpredictable nature of any excavation, even to a race as clever as the Dwemer. Surely unexpected deposits of stone or geological events could make the effort difficult. And I think that these haphazard tunnels are often the result of the search for suitable substratum to build within. I've found in a small number of ruins reference to a geological anomaly or place known as Zimio. This is intriguing, because the term not only appears in a few tablet fragments, but very specifically on ornate metal frames in the deepest reaches of the strongholds Alfton, Urkenthon, and Mazinshaleft of Skyrim. I've yet to decipher the meaning of these elaborate carvings, 
but consider it highly strange that they occur in the deepest part of each ruin. Ooh. Huh. Interesting. I, I think that this is, um... Yeah, we come into contact with that, don't we? Anyway, eventually we will, at least. Risen by order, risen by order, cousin of privilege, Kualek of Skezelin, privilege duties, clan home building Huogen Kultura, tradition to hailed world shaper. Wait, did I skip something? Yeah, I've yet to decipher the meaning of these elaborate carvings, but consider it highly strange that they occur in the deepest part of each of these ruins. Okay, no, I didn't skip anything. My mistake. The most reasonable translation of I have managed to decipher is Blackest Kingdom Reaches. Mmm. But I cannot imagine what that means. I suspect there may be some pattern I'm failing to notice. This creeping doubt has haunted my career in recent years, and I've begun to doubt if I will unravel some grand secret of the dwarves in my lifetime, though it lies just under my nose, or indeed, under my feet. Ah, very cool. Very cool foreshadowing, right? Nee, do you ever meet Thelway? Do you ever meet this person, or are they, like, long dead? Hmm, I don't know. They do- I think that's, like, an elven name, so it's possible that they- they're still alive, even if this is written, like, many, many years ago. Hmm. It'd be cool if you- even if you don't meet them in Skyrim, if perhaps you meet them elsewhere. Hmm. Alright, like I said, in between videos, we'll do a little bit of inventory management. We'll probably have to ditch some stuff, because we're quite encumbered. But, nonetheless, we will prevail. You know what? I'm kind of eyeing ditching some of these camping supplies. We're carrying around like 50 units of camping supply. I'm thinking that's going to be it. Anyway, until next time, please take care of each other.